Hello everyone, it's Dmitry Anoshin and Surfalytics and today I want to talk about Model 4 and this introduction for the Model 4 and Model 4 is about data integrations in ETL. We already learned about what is business intelligence, what the database is, we learn about SQL structure query language, we learn about basic of analytics and some prerequisite skills like Git, CLI. So now we will actually learn the core skill for data warehousing. As you know, data warehousing is pretty old term. Databases, integrations with the different data sources, it's also available for a very long time. Uh, this particular model will learn what is ETL, extract, transform, load, what is ELT, extract, load, transform, what's the difference? We'll practice a lot with hands-on, with uh, ETL tool. We will start with open source ETL tool Pintaho, data integration. This really nice UI tool, open source, it's working on Windows, Linux and Mac OS. We'll build some pipelines using our Superstore data set. We'll learn DBT, we'll learn some cloud offering, open source and commercial like Fivetran, or open source maybe Miltano and Airbyte. We'll load the data in Postgres database, maybe we'll spin up some cloud databases and trying to to apply dimensional modeling skills. In the model two, we learn what is data modeling, but here we can practice more and we can use ETL jobs and ETL pipelines to build our first slowly change dimensional model and learn more about this with hands-on. You will learn new things and this is basically the starting of deeper dive into the profession because the model one to three, we just learn what is a business intelligence developer, who is data analyst, what the key skills like databases, BI tools and SQL, and now we actually start doing some data integration works. And this is the, the very first step for data engineer role. And as you know, it's, it's maybe covering almost 50% for analytics engineer. Let's get started. Thank you.